report by student representative. So this month was very special because I got to see the 8th graders from the middle school come up to the high school and tour what will soon be their home for the next four years. Uh, I got to speak to some parents and students about my experience at the high school and how Monroe would very really allow students to find and deepen their passions no matter what those passions may be. I talked about how going to such a large school means that there are so many opportunities for students to ex truly explore and understand their interests. And then I emailed the middle school principal and we're setting up a time next month for the student council president, the senior class president and I to go to the middle school and talk to the National Junior Honor Society students because they're all eighth graders who have recently toured and just have an open discussion about what would help them transition to the high school, any concerns they may have, what they think will allow them to succeed so that I can bring all those thoughts back to high school administration. I really want to hear directly from the upcoming freshmen and answer any questions that they may have also. And then I had the opportunity during the past two days to travel to Albany with the Orange County Youth Bureau along with one other senior from Monroe Woodbury in order to advocate with some New York State Senators and Assembly members why youth programs are so important and why funding for such programs is so important in the state's budget. Uh, one of the programs I know the Youth Bureau has a part in is the Safe School Ambassadors um, with the high school and the middle school, which is a group of students that helps prevent the bullying and mistreatment of other students within the school. So I was very fortunate to speak about my experience with the Youth Bureau and explain to elected officials in Albany why youth programs are so important. And then today I visited Pine Tree and they told me they had succeeded in their school-wide heart incentive for the second time and are going to have a winter wonderland next Thursday, which they explained is where they get to wear their pajamas and watch movies as a reward for their good behavior. And then some of my friends in the high school had FBO Layer Model 1 competitions last week and they all did extremely well. Excellent. Thank you.